Hi guys, welcome to Marketing with AI, I'm Phil. And in today's lesson, we're going to look at using AI tools to generate unique content for social media that is non-salesy, gets people to raise up their hands and say, hey, I'm here, and gets us noticed. And that's what we want as businesses. So let's jump straight in and see exactly how we can do this. Okay, guys, for the purposes of this little example, we're going to use the feedback option in the issues. The reason why I'm using this is I'm looking to create kind of non-salesy uh, messages to share in various social media groups, primarily Facebook, which are directed towards uh, business owners. So I don't want to come across as sales, sales, sales. What I'm looking for is to provide a message that will allow some people to raise their hands and say, yeah, I'm looking for X solution and you know I'll give you feedback about what you're putting to the marketplace and um, so I'm just trying to basically get people to put their hands up to say I'm interested uh, and this is how I'm going to do it so what we're going to do is we're just going to go to product hunt and we're also going to go to Reddit and um, Reddit works really well for this I, I find so business name I've just put in a fictitious business a type of business you have so obviously you'd, you'd input all your details here um, and this is the key part so we're looking for feedback please uh, I put together an easy to use customer friendly and super affordable online store for okay so let's see what we're going to get I've left the uh, what your business does as kind of a uh, an incomplete sentence just to give uh, niches some uh, wiggle room and to see what it comes up with anyway 60 seconds hasn't gone I don't think but we jump in and we'll have a look anyway okay so Phil's marketing Inc a little online a little online store that so these I use for kind of like uh, additional brainstorming if I want to expand the, the reddit part and um, so let's see, I put together an easy to choose, customer friendly and super affordable online store for small businesses <laughs> with zero products and zero orders. Uh, you could, I'm, I'm going to be using this for um, spread simple. We could easily twist that to with uh, zero products and zero orders, but have 100 products and 10 orders within 20 minutes. I think we'd have to take the orders out of there. Um, it has a few of the core functions of an online store. We'd, we'd twist that as well. It has lots of the online, uh, lots of the core functions as the market leaders uh, for X amount of savings or whatever you want to do there. Um, feedback, please. I put together an easy to use, customer friendly and super affordable online store for small businesses. I've listed the site as a product, but I think it's really more of a service. It's not entirely finished yet, but I'm getting there. So yeah, you could easily twist that again into something for uh, to post on social media. Reddit is where I really find um, the, the, the best use for this particular feature in niches. So heading, I put together an easy to use, customer friendly, super affordable online store for my small business. What do you think? Now that I think would um, would entice people in. Uh, check out my new, new online store, it's super easy to use and was created with, to help small businesses like mine. Feedback, welcome. I changed that to feedback, good and bad. Um, welcome. <laughs> Okay, the next one, we'd have to be careful with um, branding with this, I believe. Uh, but anyway, let's have a look what it's saying. I created a Shopify type store that's 1,000% easier to use. I like that a lot. It's called Easy Shopify. We could rename this, uh, especially if you're using Spread Simple, to uh, a brand name of our own. Here's where the post I made about it. I love any and all feedback, no matter how brutal. That's fantastic. I like that a lot. So I've been using the Shopify platform for a few years now. It's fantastic. But my wife wasn't taking advantage of its full potential. Uh, <laughs> and I put together an easy to use, customer friendly and super affordable online store for her. It basically does all the thinking for her. Tell me what you think. That's that's fantastic, I think. Um, I've created an easy to use, customer friendly and super affordable online store for, and then with thoughts, uh, we'd have to expand on that. I'm looking for some feedback and help, please. I'm putting a please in there. I've been working on a super affordable online store for small businesses. It's easy to use and customer friendly. I was wondering if you had any thoughts or opinions. Yeah, that's great as well. 
Um, I built an online store for small businesses. It uses simply a powerful drag and drop system to allow you to build an online store in minutes. Definitely we can twist that as well and tweak that a little bit. No technical skills needed. Please check it out here and let me know what you think. Any feedback you would have would be greatly appreciated. So I'm going to use these guys. I'm going to tweak them a little bit. I'm going to copy and paste from one to another and I'll pop them onto uh, some of my local groups and national groups in the UK uh, which are focused around small business owners and see what kind of feedback I get. So that's how you'd use this tool, tool guys. I think that the key aspect of all these tools is to take the content that it generates, tweak it, regenerate, tweak it, regenerate and get something that works for it. It doesn't take long. It's a quick process and my goodness, you can come up with some great content. Anyway, that's all I've got for you guys. If you've got any feedback about this particular video, then give me a shout um, about what you liked, what you didn't like and we'll take it from there. Okay guys, have a great day and uh, I'll speak to you later.